Hi there, it's Angie Zimmerman, the Flower Diva, and I'm here to show you a video on how to do a fresh flower pomander. So for today, the materials that we're going to use is one of these fresh flower foam spheres. This is going to get pretty messy. I've also kept paper towels handy because this is going to get messy. Um, we're going to just use clippers today and we're going to use what's called bowl tape. This is a florist product. I'm pretty sure you can find this at your craft stores, but again, if you can't, I will make this available for purchase on my site under the products tab. And I'm just going to go ahead and place my first flower, push that in as far as it'll go, and then I'm going to cut my next flower. And same thing, starting out, I'm going to give it a little bit of a pet, which should increase its diameter just a little bit. And I'm going to go ahead and add the next flower right next to the first flower. So I don't know if you have any pets at home. I have two cats, Vinny and LB, and they love their mom. Both of them are in the kitchen with me right now. Don't be surprised from time to time if one of them decides to jump up on the counter. How fun is that? Again, carnations are a great source because they come in so many different colors. They're relatively inexpensive and um, they, they cover, you know, a pretty good amount of space. But to do this 8 inch size ball, this did take 100 carnations exactly. So enjoy. That's one of our first lessons and there will be more to come in a week. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.